What is up, everyone? We're just here at the B God Studio. Boy, you dude. We got Brandon, we got Tim, hey. we got John that almost just used some profanity, but he saved it without adding the cut. Today, we're just gonna teach you guys how to do, well, I'm gonna teach you guys how to do a head push, and then we're gonna have Brandon back here teaching y'all how to do a vert split, and hopefully a triple vert if he can knock one out. John, what's going on, I'll dude? Clean it with I'm this. filling up my mind hood. Well, uh. It's one vape to rule them all. One vape to bring them into darkness. It's not even focusing move. on the freaking mod dude if you if you actually wear it it just you disappear Tim likes to make stupid jokes and none of us laugh and then we just <laughs> get up and stop and <laughs> ha. Ha. but you know look what I'm working on an unboxing video now, on does, this beast do you want to hear Tim mess up every three seconds oh, please focus oh God, please awful. focus come on yes Tim freaking out where's the uh where's the audio you just click this five times So huge, man. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I hate these guys. Brandon, let's go. Hate them. Absolutely hate them. You guys, the reason why we're not doing these tutorials on the green screen is for obvious reasons. So yeah, I think we should probably set up some studio lighting. So uh, turn on your freaking core. One hundred. Uh, keep it one. Ah, oh, ninety-nine. That's bullcrap. Ha! Yes. Triple vert. Oh. Oh, I know I said we're gonna do head push first, but I think we're actually just gonna jump straight into the vert split for now. Brandon, would you like to give me an example? Sure. What's up? A lot of people nowadays I see doing vert splits, they have kind of have them down already, but for the people who don't do vert splits, it's a common misconception that you need to dip your face straight down into the O vertically, but that's not the case. When your O's in front of you, you kind of want to keep your face flat and, uh, Kind of in your head, keep it in front of you the whole time. It's gonna look like you're doing a backwards or reverse worm. First, you dip your head in on the top of the O, kind of swivel your, your face downwards and come back. Release your O about halfway and just replace your face with your hands to basically finish the split. Beautiful. So. Damn, son. Yeah. And that's all she wrote. Aside from getting the the motion down of your inhale and the, the hand motion at the same time, you can kind of tweak this trick as well depending on how solid or how soft your O is in the beginning. So say if you have like a slower O but it's kind of thick, you're going to have to slow down your inhale a little more and that means you're going to have to hold your head down on the O a little bit longer before you put your hands up to split it because your O is going really slow. If you have a faster one, typically the inhale is a lot quicker kind of replicates a shark bend. Basically, the faster or slower your O is is gonna determine how hard you need to inhale and set up your hands for the trick. Uh, I'll try a slow one right now, just to give you an example that you can for split with slow O's. That was beautiful. Yeah. Woohoo, almost tripled, but still clean. Any last thoughts or words or tips on the vert split? When you're first trying this out, just take your time. When I first started, I would always break my O and I would dip my face down too hard into it. You kind of just got to be gentle and let it split, you know, on its own. But of course, your mouth and your hands are going to really assist that a lot. So honestly, just don't stress it so hard. It's a lot simpler in real time if you practice it. So keep it up. Yeah. All right, so now that we got the vert split out of the way, Isaac's gonna demonstrate and explain to you guys how he does his head pushes or face pushes, whichever you wanna call them. I would probably call them a head push because when I do do a head push, I do use my forehead and probably the top of my nose. When I do it, I just take a hit of my mod and then after, let out a little bit of vape. And right before I push the O, I just cock my head back slightly, kind of like how a chicken does, or just like pow, pow, pow. So if I do bend O's really fast, I will do that. And I'll just be like pew, pew. But yes, the one that I just did now, that was a pretty decent head push. I just like head pushes because you can kind of do them whenever you want. You can be bending O's with your hands and randomly be like, pow. You can do head pushes to where it's a normal O and you can also do head pushes where you're like launching them and stuff like that. So if I wanted to launch one, I kind of just throw my head at it like, mm. <laughs> Nice little trail. Kind of weak, but I'll do another one. <laughs> what? See, like those types of head pushes, these are really good for pictures oh. and like, you know, 
Slow mouth hits. Mouth hits. Yeah. So you can do them with a mouth hit or a lung hit. Depends on what you want. If I want my O to be fatter, I'll usually do a lung hit. But if I'm just trying to like launch them and make some cool trails, then I'll just do mouth hits. Yep. Mouth hit. Lung One. hit. Woo! The lung hits you could you could travel with more, right? Yes. Yeah. Yes. Lung hits you can tr you can after you blow out the O. You kind of get those ripples, so it's like really fat, but if you just do a mouth hit, for some reason, it doesn't want to travel as long, I would say. I'll try to do it. <laughs> I mean, head pushes, if you can get them fat enough, you can do anything with them. You can do a shark split, you can do a lasso, you can do a triple shark split. I don't know if you guys have seen my stuff before, but I've hit a triple shark split off of a head push a few times. It's really fun, very satisfying. Let's uh, do a couple more head pushes, I guess. Oh! Oh my! Ow! Whoa. Ah. Ooh. <laughs> yeah guys, that's all I really got for the head push. Um, just cock your head back a little bit and commit to that O. It's my best advice for you. It's nothing really special or anything. It's just honestly just trailing that O. But now we're gonna have Brandon attempt the triple vert split, and we'll see how that goes. Damn, there it is. <laughs> I can't believe you made that work. Oh, you guys already saw it. He did it a couple times, just not super crazy clean like in his videos, but you know, you guys get the gist of it. I think right now we're just gonna try a little bit of vert splits and some combos. And uh, yeah, see how you guys can incorporate those two tricks together. Hey! Wow, there it is. <gasps> oh! We apologize for this vlog not being as crazy as we expected. We had a little bit of interruptions in the middle of us recording this, like the camera dying, and meetings, and we're supposed to be on the way home right now. I guess we'll patch it up sometime, or we'll try it again later on. Yeah, we, we thought it was gonna be a lot better, but we just had way too many distractions today, so... We apologize, but our next video that we're gonna be posting will be lit. Hope you guys like this one. Subscribe to our YouTube channel, comment down below, and we'll see you next time. Yeah.